welcome 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 back to my channel thanks for all um the support yeah people people social media gone to a different level mm -hmm. yeah they you not know, safe anymore yeah so much things are going uh -huh. I don't know if we start, I don't know if we talk, yeah, because so might you know want to talk, mm -hmm. yeah, but something, me see, me I walk past my the page and me see something, but I don't to say that yet, but, um, Chris Page, yeah, that's a Chris Page I'm missing, mm -hmm. yeah, couldn't find him, couldn't find him Page, yeah, so, when me um go go investigate, you know, I have found up to go investigate me see Chris in a one different yard. Yeah, attack. And he was stressed out. I'm thinking mighty God. When you have so much followers, yeah, and your page gone missing, mm -hmm, yeah. Um, you know, it takes you all this time to build up your um, you know, and your page, you know, being taken down or gone missing, that must be devastated. You must be devastated like that, about that, because you got over um hundred thousand, hundred thousand followers, yeah. And then page go go missing. Mighty God, that would be really, really. But luckily, in get in get back in page, yeah. And so, um, the thing when we want to touch upon, it's a very sensitive topic but everybody I talk about this to continue so you know for a man just want to promote you know well we the promoting the things but um a motherly love we want to say touch this yeah motherly love yeah we want to touch upon so um a psychologist look at motherly love to protect possessive affection which a mother will typically display um to their child throughout their life yeah and it's unconditional um and everlasting and as i say if it's a bond a special bond between two people that can never be broken yeah it's like a, a chain a strong chain that never that you can't break <laughs> you can't break that link yeah so uh, that is a little definition when we find <laughs> So, I thought, Missy, I mean, why I touch upon it in a very sensitive way, although people were saying, is the man of England very, you know, um, very insensitive, yeah, if they put out, they fit the, um, put out that information about TC child, but I know there's some Missy, Missy, somewhere else too, mm -hmm. so, I know just the man of England put it out, yes, so, uh, yeah, so that's what we want to just touch upon. So, um, yeah, me see, it, me see, I may have walked past and me see it up, and then Mrs. TC put up a statement. And, um, for me, you know, anybody can sit here, and we don't want to take it's wrong for people to take sickness and certain things and cause people, yeah. However, TC who cost people about things too. And from what we can see, Mana England was telling her to go start out her data business, go start out her business and leave people business alone. And so we kind of did read it, you yeah, know, pick up for nobody. But I saw me see, because when we see this statement out there, we was thinking, oh my God, you know, it's not right to put it out there. But the data put it out there and somebody copy and paste it here yeah, and put it out there. And as I said before, TC need to tell her data to keep her business off social media. She have people she talk to to do it like that. Obviously, she's using her page still to, you know, that's her way of using her platform. On another hand, to help other people so other people might get some kind of comfort from this too that's going through treatment it's not right i'm gonna say but social media become that kind of warfare um place where nobody have no um consideration about people's feelings and 
um, um, Chris put it out there. I don't we see it somewhere else, and obviously, a people are trying to say TC every minute she's upon media. I talk things about people and people's kids too. So, I'm not saying it's right and I'm not saying it's wrong, but she does the same thing too. So, how can you defend? I can't really defend her by saying, Oh my god, why you do it to her? You know, she's never trouble nobody, you know. So, and that bit we're gonna say, but get back to the motherly love now. But I just feel that this is daughter by the statement she put out, she's crying half for support from our mother. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Maybe me wrong, yes, yeah, so, but he's saying she's having I've been having more conversation with strangers. Yeah. And uh, yeah, and she's mentioned God too. So she's a yeah, spiritual side to her as well. But she's having conversation with strangers. She's not saying my mom is supporting me as well. You know, I'm, nobody was mentioned other than strangers. So that's what I draw out of this to say. The daughter is, you know, the daughter feels that her mom is, maybe the daughter feels her mom is not strong enough to support her. So that is why she's having more conversations with strangers. So maybe mom, from what I can get, it looks like the daughter is, the, the stronger person in this relationship. She's probably the one that the kind of motherly role here. Yeah, so, mm -hmm. yeah, that's all me pick it out, pick out sense of nonsense here. Yeah, so, yeah. And so, um, you know, and I think TC, yeah, probably does need to give her daughter, uh, you know, give her daughter a little bit more support than being on the social media all the time. Yeah, causing problems and you know we say this to say that that she does lick you know people wear hurt too so that's why i'm saying that you know i like you know it's wrong what people are doing but at the same time she do these things to people probably not the chemotherapy or whatever you know that sort of thing and i say yeah this is a low blow for true but you do she does things as well which is low blow because she was out there about lady v data and all them things there and you know me see it at places i mean no i fear i'd page them because somebody come out and say that she's got a couple other names she go by and we know that she's got several pages out there that she put things out there so your daughter is crying out for support yeah you know and that's it, you know, strangers, we need family. Sometimes people feel so they can't talk to strangers more than family because they're not getting that support from family, from them family. So no family was mentioned as strangers. So that, me pick out tight anyway. But the part that touched me, to be honest, was the part where she says, uh, she, she leave a message and say she appreciates all the kind of words from followers about her daughter um, and all this. And she says, but her daughter is strong and she will be okay, which is a positive statement to say she will be okay because we want to remain positive to say that she's going to be okay, yes. And, um, you know, the word strong, people always say you're strong. Yes, you're strong because you do, you're not crying and you're supporting everybody and all that they're saying you're strong but sometimes you have to be strong because there's no other way you're not getting support from other people so you have to be strong it's like you have to get on with it you know because there's no you know nobody else ain't going to pick up the pieces for you. you have to pick it up yourself and although she, this um young lady might be married with kids you know um you know she still need a child need their mother no matter what yes uh, when you you know your 50s and so and your mother you know you you feel say you know you still need that little cuddle and all that from your pet from your mother yeah so anyway and that me i go say and i say to maybe you know we criticize them we're saying all this but to that individual maybe she thinks that she's doing a great job you know and other people on the outside looking in and thinking oh you know this and all that but we don't know really what goes on behind closed doors but i think it's a statement that was made yes so mm -hmm. and you know people always have to say 
Couscous not bring good words, yes. And an individual I'm here come out and defend him. There's a lot of things that's going on on social media that she doesn't run out and say anything about it, but them always run out, you know, and that's why it looks so one-sided when people are saying this and saying that. And yes, a treatment like and somebody having chemotherapy and going through cancer treatment, I don't think it's anything for anybody to say, you know, you know, and you know, we don't want to gloat about anybody misfortune and so on. But <clears throat> I think for that individual, the man of England, I think she did do something. I want Dali a kick, kick, run. I saw me hear it and I saw me just I repeat it. I kick, kick, run and I say all kind of thing and pop up Dali hand and do all kind of stuff. I don't know. I saw me hear it. So to him, it's like. Is pointing out where you know things are you know it's like some people like to say a karma yeah we we'll say it's karma what goes wrong what you wish bad for another man come wrong if it if you dig a hole if you dig two it's that kind of thing that people tend to say to say these days yeah but you know we have to think really to say sickness anybody can sick you know and I think TC needs to you know focus on you know our family affairs yes and you know show love to a daughter yeah and so on and so on but me some of me i look kind of me i listened the other day our friend come out and i talk and the friend was saying this daughter was always very mature because the person was saying about when the daughter they come out on instagram I was talking some things up the other day and she was saying she does this xyz for her mom and so on and so on so maybe you know um you know the daughter's very uh, very mature and you know take that motherly role you know there's always one that take on that motherly role you know if, don't know she might be the old the eldest one maybe she's she's take on the motherly role to you know make sure everybody are right and support them so everybody see her as a strong link of the family and all this i don't know but i let me ever say that you know sometimes we need to you know take less take time out of social media and focus on um what really matters in our family life because i think some people take spend too much time on social media going on and cussing out people and then you know at the end of the day they're not getting anywhere really with it they just instead of tearing down people they're tearing themselves down and like that fine woman i would say yeah um and fine woman don't talk and she's out